Manchester United have reportedly moved a step closer to signing Frankie de Jong by agreeing to pay the £17 million that the Netherlands international is owed by Barcelona in deferred wages. Due to the club's financial issues and the problems caused by the COVID-19 pandemic, de Jong came to an agreement with the Catalan side which would see him have the money paid over the remainder of his deal, which is due to expire in 2026. According to Sport, Man United initially refused to pay the figure, said to be in the region of £17 million, but the 20-time English champions have now made it clear that they are prepared to take on the debt. As a result, the Red Devils have allegedly moved a step closer to agreeing a deal for the Dutchman, who has also been strongly linked with Chelsea in recent days. De Jong has been at the centre of one of the biggest transfer sagas of the summer, with Man United thus far being unable to bring him to Old Trafford despite weeks of negotiations. Barcelona president Joan Laporta recently insisted that the Catalan giants are keen to keep hold of the midfielder this summer. Frankie is Barca player. We want him to stay, he wants to stay. We've received important bids for him but he's our player, Laporta told reporters. You know salary budget situation so we will do our best to keep Frankie at Barker, and I hope he'll do the same. De Jong made 46 appearances for Barcelona in all competitions during the 2021-22 campaign, contributing four goals and five assists in the process, and he is still viewed as an important player by the club. However, the Catalan side's summer business means that they are under pressure to make a big sale, and the club are privately said to be keen to move for the former Ajax on before the end of the transfer window. De Jong has been involved in his side's preparations for the new season and played the opening 45 minutes of Saturday's 2-0 victory over MLS outfit New York Red Bulls. And United would allegedly not legally be able to assume the debt, but they could come to an agreement where they pay the £17 million through bonuses and wages. Red Devils boss Eric Ten Hag is said to have made the midfielder a priority target when he first held transfer meetings with the 20-time English champions. Man United are believed to be prepared to pay the Dutchman a salary of £450,000 a week, which would make him the second best paid player at the club behind Cristiano Ronaldo. The Premier League club have already brought three new players to Old Trafford this summer, with Terrell Malasia, Lisandro Martinez and Christian Eriksen arriving to boost the squad. Man United concluded their preparations for the 2022-23 campaign with a 1-1 draw with Rayo Vallecano at Old Trafford on Sunday afternoon.